All right, hello everybody. Thank you for tuning in today. I am going to show you how to go God mode and flip ships if you really want in Sea of Thieves. And you can do this on PC, you can do this on Xbox, and you don't need cheats or anything like that to do it. Although, if you have them, it will help. Here are the requirements for doing this. First and foremost, you must have a brigantine. All right. Secondly, you must have a barrel harpoon onto the left harpoon, like so. Thirdly, you're going to vote up an hourglass, All right? If you have access to a cheat where you can give yourself water speed, I'd grab some blunder bombs. If not, don't worry about it. Next, did I already vote on the map? All right, vote on the map so that way you can dive for matchmaking. Drop your front sail. Make sure your harpoon is properly centered. Oh, let's raise the anchor as well. So, here's the story so far. You're gonna have a brigantine. You're gonna have a barrel harpoon to the left harpoon. You're going to vote up hourglass. Make sure you're near an island while you're doing this. You're going to vote up hourglass and vote up on the map. You're then going to set sail. And as soon as you start setting sail, go ahead and jump onto that barrel. And all you do is wait. Eventually, the ship will dive underwater for matching. <clears throat> so we'll go over what happens next. After the ship dives and is underwater, awaiting a match, I will still be on this barrel, and so will you if you stand here. Stand towards the back of the barrel like I am, pretty close to the falling, pretty close to falling off into the water. All right, you're gonna be far away from the ship. Don't fall off though. Make sure you don't fall off while you're sailing. So what will happen is when it, the ship dives and I'm underwater, you will still be on the barrel. All you have to do is walk backwards and fall off the barrel. And it will teleport you away and above, away from the ship and above the ship. You will be up higher in the water, whatever. At that point, if you do not have cheats, just drown. And you better hope you drown before you find a match. Because if not, you wasted your time and you gotta start all over. If you have access to cheats where you can have water speed, use your water speed and hurry up and swim over to an island and blunder bomb the ground and kill yourself. After that, you will be on the Ferry of the Dam while still waiting for a match. So what you're going to do then is wait for the match while on the Ferry. And we will go from there. So we dove underwater. I have access to cheats, so I'm going to do it a different way. I fall off the ship, and you come here. At this point, if you don't have cheats, just stay there and drown. I do have cheats, so I'm going to swim over to this island to make it easier. So that way I can kill myself quickly and not you put into a match and ruin it. So if you're on Xbox, just drown and cross your fingers that you don't find a match yet. Did I find a match? I think I may have found a match. No, I didn't. Alright. I gotta get to an island. I'm actually being super uneven. <laughs> no, I think I found a match. I oh, know I didn't. Alright. So I'll blunder the thing, kill myself. And now we are on the ferry while searching for a match. Okay. So now we will stand here and wait until we find a match. So, yeah. People were saying, yo, to all the people who are saying that I lied about knowing how to do this, no, that's not true. I actually did upload this video for like two hours and I deleted it because I wanted to, I, I don't know, I changed my mind, I didn't want everybody knowing about it. But I've gotten my use, so I don't care if it gets patched. So you guys can go ahead and enjoy this. Oh, by the way, by the way, actually, <laughs> I should probably throw this in there. If you're on Xbox or something, or don't have cheats, you're going to want somebody else in your crew as well. 
because what's going to happen is that if there's nobody on your ship when it finds a match and teleports into the match, your ship's going to stay underwater. But if you have somebody on your ship, your ship will come out of water like normal. But if you're alone, this is what's going to happen. You'll teleport back to your ship, like this, and the ship is going to stay underwater. And you're going to have to swim all the way over there without speed hacks or whatever, if you're on Xbox. If you're not on Xbox, you'll be in battle. You'll be in battle right now. And you'll be god mode. I'm god mode right now. I'm a ghost. I am god mode. I promise. While you're god mode, you can't pull out guns. So you can't shoot people. You can interact with ships and whatnot. All that good noise. We'll go do it right now. See how I just came off the thing? Alright. I can now swim back to the mainland with my water speed. Am I moving? Alright. Usually don't go this slow. Something is uh, a mess right now. Okay, well usually you do not go this slow. Hopefully it'll fix itself. Alright, there it goes. So we'll find a ship real quick. And I'll show you that I am god mode. Well, I kind of don't want the ship to see me, not gonna lie. So, and I don't want to, I don't want to fuck myself either, so I'm going to turn this off. But we'll go find a ship real quick and we'll flip it. Because you can only flip ships in god mode. And I'll teach you guys how to actually do the flipping of the ship. If you guys want to get a cheat to make this way easier for you, I'll leave all the information to the one I'm using down below the best sheet available by the way the best sheet available that isn't a scam <laughs> watch out for scams and see of thieves community by the way here's a ship we'll send this ship into oblivion all right here's how you flip a ship let me see if i can find the owner of the ship real quick because i really don't care no fuck that Alright, we're just gonna flip it. Here's how you flip a ship. Alright. There, his ship's... It's, it's, a, it's a land lubber ship. I, I put his ship onto the island. Yeah, when you're in god mode, by the way, the islands are gonna be super de-rendered like this and shit as well, so... Stay aware of that. We'll give the ship one more good launch. I'll we'll call it a wrap. Alright. If you guys like this and you guys found this video helpful and you would like to show some appreciation, hey, consider subscribing. Consider leaving a like. If you don't like me showing people how to do this, I understand. But hey, this is going to get a patch. This video is going to get this patched. So go abuse this while you can. And we will review the steps one final time. First, get a brigantine. Secondly, harpoon a barrel onto the left harpoon of the brigantine. Thirdly, vote up our glass and map. Fourth, set sail and then jump onto the barrel on the left harpoon and wait till you dive underwater. When you dive underwater, fall off the barrel and drown. Or, if possible, speed hack to a nearby island and blunder bomb yourself to death. Five, or whatever number we're on, stay on the ferry until you find a match and you'll be teleported back to your ship. And then you are in god mode and you are able to flip ships. So, that is it. I love you guys. Stay safe and enjoy the Sea of Thieves.